So inverse functions, or two functions that undo each other. Here's a magic trick. I want you to think of a number, any number, think of a number, any number at all. And then I want you to Add 8 to that number. Okay, so you got the answer in your head? Now, take your answer, and I want you to subtract 8 from it. Subtract 8 from the answer. I can tell you, you got the same number you started with. Well, that's not much of a magic trick, is it? <laughs> okay. So, you got the same number you started with. Sometimes these little number games... You know, sometimes I'll see them... <clears throat> Uh, do, do this, do that, you know, and, and they got you jumping through these hoops. And it's really kind of disguised sometimes as if it's something as simple as this. But they'll disguise it by, you know, doing a little smoke screen so maybe people don't recognize it. So, um, but <coughs> that's, that's what we mean by inverse functions. These two little rules add A to a number, Subtract 8 from the answer. Add 8, subtract 8. They undo each other. These are inverse functions. Let me, let me put a little note there. These two rules, because I described a function as a rule, these two rules are inverse functions. They undo each other. 